This is a video by a friend of mine he just put out. Dave WM, he's like the vintage color tube guy uh, of the East Coast. I'm the vintage color tube guy of the West Coast. If you're interested in vintage color tube televisions, you should subscribe to him. Anyway, he he's done several of these safety glass removals and this one didn't go so hot for him. And I get, want you guys to check out this video because this shows the uh, importance of wearing safety equipment. You guys see me wearing an MSA helmet with a riot shield, uh, ballistics, like a ballistics safety shield, face shield. And this is the reason why these things can go off at any time for no reason. So I want you guys to check out this video and check out Dave WM if you're into vintage television. And patience. If you're going to do a cataract removal, a PVA removal from a CRT, you need to have patience and take your time. Because an unbanded CRT with the bonding agent removed becomes an IED. It's no longer a C CRT, it's an IED with that. Even once you put the safety glass back on with the silicone, it doesn't have the strength that it does with that bonding agent in there. I've said this before, it's like the plastic in a car windshield. Nice sunny day out here in Central Florida. And a good day to do a CRT cataract removal. It's a 23B CRT sitting in a plastic garbage can that's weighted. You see it down in the bottom with some heavy bricks so it's, it was top heavy with the bricks there to all keep it balanced out. Got the sun heated up a little bit. We've already made some or removed some of the plastic around the edges. I'll be working my wedges, these clothespins in there in a few minutes. And sometimes this happens. It's a little bit of uneven pressure and you get a break. So this is trashed. I don't know. Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. Got a face shield on it, so it's all, all good. Okay, take two, or three, this is the same CRT I was working on that I was trying to remove the glass. It went horribly wrong when I apparently applied the incorrect kind of pressure to one of the corners of the safety glass. It broke, and I've been struggling with it for ever since then to try to get the glass off. Once you lose your, your finger hold on the bottom of the glass, and you get into the good solid PVA material, it becomes almost impossible to get it off. I'll give you an example. I got this plastic sheet trying to increase the heat. But here it is right now. And as you can see, it's a mess. It's all chipped up. This is me trying to get it loose. The glass is still in good shape. There's no scratches or anything. This is just the CRT itself. I got this one wedge in there. I'm trying to I don't know if that's working anymore, but let's see what the temperature is. It's up to 120 degrees right now. Under the black plastic. It's not that hot. It's supposed to hit about 90 today. So we're hoping that with heat, and if I can get some pressure on there, I might still be able to get that thing loose. We'll see. More to come. Okay, let's see how this is coming. That's pretty good. 170 degrees. Let's see what it is underneath the plastic. It's 150 degrees underneath the plastic. what happens when things
things go wrong. I came out this morning and just barely touched the screen. I just was going to attach that to the glass. And I just touched that edge to one edge of the glass. I mean, I don't mean bang it, I mean just touched it. Kaboom! Massive implosion. And here's what you get after that happens. Left of this, it's kind of uh, it's kind of cooked looking here. I don't know what that's all about. This was a rebuilt. We would still see there's bits and pieces of the fragments laying around. I don't know if you see that or not. Glass everywhere. I'm still making it up. So this is not without this is not without hazard. This is why you have to wear protective gear. You always see Shang with his uh, combat gear on. This is why. Not a bad idea. All these fragments went everywhere. I got hit, fortunately. Only one small spot. Right here you can see a small cut. Yeah, I'll be out here picking up glass for a while, it looks like. Could have been really bad. So, don't consider this a hazard free operation by any stretch of imagination. Anyway, that's what's left of my good testing 23B CRT.